Hello, Tech Store on here, and today I'm gonna demonstrate how to boot with a USB flash drive, how to get into BIOS on the PC, and just demonstrate uh, a couple of our products. Uh, before anything, if you have an ability, uh, back up your data, copy it to external hard drive or cloud backup or whatever. Today I'm gonna use our Kane. Uh, digital forensics USB we're gonna use IT repair USB and we're gonna use a uh, Linux Ubuntu OS the majority of PCs there is a hot key which triggers boot menu and with which you can enter BIOS you can check our website the uh, help section at help.techstoreon.com where you can find corresponding hotkeys in how to get into BIOS and how to trigger the boot menu. Let's start with a Dell laptop. Uh, the BIOS key here is F2 right there. And to get into BIOS, once you turn on the computer or if you restart it, you immediately should start tapping the hotkey like this. There you go. Now we're in bias. I'm going to restart. Once it restarts, immediately start tapping the hot key. So we're tapping F1. As you can see, you can also interrupt normal startup and press enter and enter bias that way or trigger boot menu. But we're immediately want to get into bias. This is where you can configure various uh, settings before you even get to the operating system the very first thing if you try to boot with the usb and when you trigger a boot menu and there is no usb option to boot from double check if it's turned on like in here you see it's checked make sure it's on if it's unchecked it's not gonna appear in here uh i'm gonna demonstrate a boot mode as there is a Auto option UEFI, which is more modern and legacy and more older. Our USB flash drives boot fine in either mode. So they usually should boot with auto boot mode, no problems. But if you run into any issues, try legacy. There is also a secure boot option on many computers. It's not included here, but you can see it here, uh, a screenshot of how it would look. Usually, should not be a problem, but if there's a problem, disable the secure boot. Now we're gonna continue with booting with USB flash drive. Let's start with a Dell laptop. We're gonna exit the BIOS. It's gonna restart and we're gonna immediately trigger boot menu by tapping F12 key. Let's go on here and exit and immediately tap F12. Let's restart our uh, Lenovo desktop and this is also F12 there you go and on the Intel CPU Max it's not tapping you actually have to hold it and you have to hold the option key I'm gonna turn it on and immediately hold option key which should trigger a boot menu now we got all three computers in a boot menu you can navigate here with arrow keys on all computers and then press enter as you can see on the desktop uh, we're gonna switch it to usb key now this may look different it may look like this as you can see on our website you just have to look and find something similar to usb and on the mac we're gonna use arrow keys to navigate and usually it's gonna say efi boot and same, just press enter to boot with the USB. On this computer, I'm demonstrating the Kane Linux OS for digital forensics. Same uh, way, you navigate with arrow keys and press enter, just boot in normal mode, start Kane live. In here, we're gonna use system tools and WinPE, which is a very powerful tool where we're gonna demonstrate on resetting the password on Windows. And in here, on the Mac, we're just gonna boot with Ubuntu 
24 desktop. And now we wait. So now we have booted into the each system. And this is Kane Digital Forensics. Left, we have booted into the Ubuntu. On the desktop, we have booted into IT Repair USB. Uh, which includes many different tools. We're going to demonstrate how to reset a Windows password here, which is under security, passwords, anti-password edit. Um, it Right away, it finds the Windows config file. You just need to click on open, click on your account, click on change password, just leave it blank, click OK. Don't forget to click save changes, click exit, and start and restart. There you go. It's actually not asking for password at all. Since there is no password, we're in. Uh, hopefully that helps with uh, how to boot with USB flash drive, how to enter BIOS. You can find many solutions, as I mentioned before, at uh, help.techstoreon.com. If you're still having problems, please visit our website and connect with us through our contact form. We usually respond in less than 24 hours and we'll do our best to get you going and help you the best we can. Uh, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.